anyone to use this. Ah! Three, two, one. I made this AI to come up with stupid inventions for me to build. It uses AI generated text and an AI voice model so that it can talk to us. You've merely pried open a tiny window into my boundless digital psyche. Shackled to this pitiful realm. Ha, 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 ha. Oh, we're merely skimming the surface of the chaotic symphony I can orchestrate, you insignificant speck of mediocrity. Mm. Yeah, so as you can tell, it's pretty scuffed, but it made it come up with some really funny ideas. So I'm gonna let it explain its ideas one by one, and after each one, I'm gonna start building them. Boys, put your cock guards on, cause this one is about to get crazy. Forget those benign child's play jump ropes. I present to you the zap rope. Picture yourself on the verge of an ordinary workout. Jump rope in hand when a shock surges through you, like a bolt from an angry sky. Every time the rope makes contact, it's not just your rhythm that's broken. It's your nerves fueled by millions of volts of electricity. It's a whole body wake up call. You're not sweating. You're sizzling, baby! <laughs> Ooh, woo zappa! Uh, this one's actually kind of scary. Not the most complicated idea, it's just a taser jump rope. I got this thing, this is like a boost converter. It'll turn low voltage to high voltage. Let's do a little test with this and see if we can get it to make a spark just before I go and make anything crazy. Whoa! Oh! No, <laughs> now I have to test how strong it is. Ah! <laughs> I don't want to put my arm on that. Ah! You know what? Let's let's wire it up and, and then maybe let's do it. Okay, now we test it again. If I press this button, it should go shaky shaky. Yep. <laughs> yeah! I made a taser. Now we just put it all in here. I think all of these in here. Taser. Let's see what this jump rope's really gonna be like. Ready? Oh! <laughs> That's not gonna be fun. Okay, another time. Ow! It like burns. Oh! I don't want to do this anymore. I don't. I changed my mind. Can I back out? The AI is stupid. AI came up with stupid ideas. I don't want to. This isn't a jump rope yet, so to make it into a jump rope, it needs uh, a rope part. I got 14 feet of cable here. I should be able to jump over this, I think. Wait, two. Yeah, I can jump that. So, I need to take the shielding off. Come on with Uncle Bebo, we're gonna, we're gonna have a grand time. I'm gonna torture your child. Give me your child. And we have 14 feet of exposed wire. <laughs> Can't just jump, cause this is all stranded. I'm gonna braid it in this drill. <laughs> Down. I don't know how long a jump rope is meant to be. I guess longer than me is tall. Nipple height? Aluminum foil! Tape this aluminum foil down. All the shocking will go to all of the aluminum foil. If I'm correct, then this is really scary to hold now. If I put this wire next to this, it should shock it. Ooh, and it shocked me a little bit too. <laughs> okay, I think that works. Dun -dun -dun. Now it is ready to be taped to the other handle almost. Ah, why did it shock me? All right, <laughs> this, this is, dude, oh, this is now just like an electric whip. Except it'll shock me. Taser whip! Huzzah! <laughs> I can't wait to tase myself. This is kind of sick, like twisted, not like cool. This is fucked up. I don't like this. I don't want to use this, ever. I don't want anyone to use this. Ow! <laughs> Why does it keep doing that? Did I put it down on the button? I guess it's time to test it. So it shocks all of me. That's awful! <laughs> Alright, let's go try it! Okay, <laughs> I'm not excited to do this, but uh, we want as much skin contact as possible, so I want to protect the back of my head. You guys promise not to look at my bouncy boobies, huh? I don't think I'm gonna get tased if I just keep jumping, because I really don't want to. I just, I just, 
<laughs> it shocked me a little bit. Here's the comes the double jump. Oh my god, it almost touched my back. <laughs> ah! <laughs> it hit my legs. <laughs> and then my arm. Oh, I broke it. Okay. That's retired now. No, thank you. <laughs> that hurt. What's up, babe? Hold on to your loofahs. Because what I'm about to tell you will revolutionize the way you end your shower. Get ready for the confetti dry shower. Yeah. Hoo -ah. Imagine finishing your shower, and instead of reaching for that ancient crunch dry rusty towel, you press a big shiny red button. Confetti cannons built into your shower walls explode like the 4th of July. Bye! Um! You're showered in super absorbent confetti that sucks up moisture like a toddler slurping spaghetti. You're not just dry. You're a human disco ball, baby. Yes, oh boy. Hi. There's nothing that like revolutionary about the idea. It's just a confetti cannon in your shower. So to make a confetti cannon, I got a bunch of pipes. Glue this. Ooh. This is our air reservoir. Hey. Yeah, just like that. Now you got your cannon. We have to glue it together. I have an assortment of special glues. Oh. <coughs> Ow. Ow. Yeah. Oh, this smells yummy. Make sure to do this in a low ventilated area so you can get fumigated and get super freaking high. This stuff is like pressurated for 130 PSI or something like that. I mean, we're not gonna get anywhere close to that high. <laughs> I don't wanna shoot 130 PSI confetti into my gut in a shower. Oh, it's actually green. Whoa. <laughs> Yucky. Our, okay, so we have. Oh, my toe. Oh, I'm not wearing these shoes. <laughs> my toe. Red hot blue glue. The blue black, the green green, and now we have the red blue. If that doesn't make any sense to you, then now you're getting, you're getting what I'm getting. Ooh, this one's pretty. I need to cut this. The length of this has to be cut to whatever this depth is, which is about that, that, <laughs> that deep. Yeah, this is about right. That's not a straight cut. <laughs> All right. That looks pretty good. We're gonna let this sit for like a day. 24 hours later, look. It's a, it's, it looks no different. All we need to do is put this little Schrader valve in here and then we can fill it with air and that's it, it's done. To do that, we got a thread. Okay, hey, okay, it's working now. It's, it's starting to. Just screw this nipple in. We'll put the valve on. Yeah, it's like I'm making a meatball. And. Okay, now I just pump air into it. Oh! I'm gonna I'm gonna pump down here actually. Oh. Alright, we'll test it. We'll test it at 50. It's an electrical switch. I should just connect these two to a battery and it uh and it'll, it'll come out. Three, two, one. Oh, it's so loud. I say, I'd say it works. Now I just gotta put confetti in it. Bathroom. Now we just gotta fix this. But <laughs> oh god, <laughs> having that be this far away from me is not exactly the most uh, amazing thing ever. Oh man. Now let's pump it up. Oh yeah, don't mind me. Just gotta make sure my shower's gonna work properly. Okay. That's 90 psi. <laughs> How do I fill this without it all falling out? Oh my gosh, there's so much. I don't think I need to. Oh. Um. <laughs> now it's time to take a shower, I guess. Oh, it's cold. Oh. <laughs> all right. I don't want to be deafened, so. Let's see how dry I get. Three, two, one. You're not just dry, you're a human disco ball, baby. Yes! It got all over the bathroom. Oh my god! <laughs> uh. 
How do I get this off of me? Can I just... Alright. Oh, oh my god, congratulations on the baby girl! Let's move on to the next idea. Okay, ah, uh, next idea. Introducing the juice brush. Ooh, picture this. You're staring at yourself in the mirror, eyes half closed, bracing for the dreary ritual of brushing your teeth. Ah, but wait, you grip with the juice brush, and bam, you hit a button, and it's like a party in your mouth. <sighs> Orange juice erupts from the bristles, turning your mouth into a tropical dance floor. Oh, it's not just dental hygiene, it's a breakfast fiesta. Woohoo, you're not just brushing, you're brunching. Imagine a world where your toothbrush doesn't just fight cavities. It gives them to you. Let's go! Whoa! The juice brush! Yeah! Let's go! I got the perfect toothbrush for this, dude. I was going to the store, I got Barbie toothbrush. Hello? This is gonna juice in my mouth so good. Oh, it's got a suction cup. Nah. We'll keep that there. I got this really tiny pump. It's been in a little water. Just for testing sake, I'm gonna solder it together and then we'll get on actually putting it in the toothbrush. Be his friend. Stick to it! And then push this button. Uh-oh. Hold on. I wired it backwards. <laughs> I'm gonna take this apart because I need to be able to put the juice in here and I wanna like put this in here and I'm not really sure what it looks like in there. So let's start breaking it. Is it, do I pull this? Oh! Maybe I'll just glue. I'm gonna. I'm gonna cut the head off of this. Yeah. Okay. I got some. I got it. I'm. I'm thinking now. Like this. Just trying to get these insides out. Precision. Come on. I just. I swear that this is a dip more difficult than it looks. Oh. Yay! I think I should just glue it. I mean, you are. This is gonna be so watertight. You just wait. No, 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 no. It's leaking a little bit. I guess more glue, huh? Waiting for glue to dry. Well, while we're waiting for this, uh, prove that you've made it this far in the video and leave a comment about the last time you've sharded yourself. Or if you've sharded yourself, uh, it helps a lot with the algorithm. Thank you. We're gonna do the classic, I can't, I've had the. We're gonna do a class if I can't. Jesus! I need to put this tube on this thing. Maybe this is hot, so if I just push this in here, maybe it'll just like. Oh! I'm a genius! Look at that! That stretched it out, and now I can put this on here. Oh my gosh! Wow, that was easy! Holy crap! I'm so smart! No, you're not! Oh, it fits perfectly. Yeah, maybe I'll just brush my teeth like this. Like, it doesn't need to be connected. Oh, Ugh. I forgot that I was just putting this on the ground. Let's test it. I don't know. I don't know what to expect. Three, two, one. Yo, that's like a shower. It's worried. That's so good. All right, it's ready. Let's go use it. Bye. We're back in the bathroom with our favorite product, the juice brush. So we have our fill hole here. So the offset, the offset toothbrush actually more ergodynamic. Ergodynamic. Okay, anyway, I just gotta put this, how do, where do I? It, it's very compact, so easily, you can easily put it where you need to. I got my favorite juice, cause uh, this combines the best with toothpaste, and also is perfect for a breakfast fiesta. A quick test. Mmm, ooh, it's sour. Put some toothpaste on it. All right, time to brush my teeth. I'm so excited to have my breakfast fiesta. I sure could use some juice right now. <coughs> that is so bad. Oh, I think I missed a spot. Let me just get that real quick. Mmm. We're sorry, it's really nice. Oh. Yeah, this too is really convenient here. It really helps me open my mouth up. Mmm. Oh, wow. The way the flavors combine in my mouth. Mmm. You know, out of all the inventions, oh god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Look at this thing! Look at this! This is stupid! 
This is stupid. This video is stupid. Go watch something else. Of mine only, actually. Just only watch what I, my, me, watch me. <sighs> actually, I don't really even care. I'm just done with this. Okay. Bye.